Oh, that is not one that I want to fight. Okay, yeah, I can fight you. Hello, Master Shadow. Hello, Big Mac. You stumbled onto one of my old Roblox videos earlier? Oh, jeez. I would say I'm sorry, but that's what you get for digging. What you get for watching me then, I guess. Specifically how the YouTube recommend its work. Yeah. Let's get him. Exactly. Dude, already nano time. Let's go. Catch you later. <coughs> Volcano toads. Where are those? Not here. Oh, Monkey Mountain. Okay. Well, before we head over there, All aboard. Off we go. Hey, where you going? SpongeBob obstacle. Oh, 
what is and probably will always be my most watched video on YouTube. SpongeBob Adventure Avi. The one with like over half a million views. Yeah. As I said, I would say I was sorry, but that's what you get for, for being subbed and watching my content. Don't make the rules. I don't know why that thing has so many fucking views. That thing is so fucking big, and I had no idea why. I can't enlist it either, because a lot of my fucking views can't come from that. TBH. I've thought about just, like, republicizing all of my fucking videos, but I'm like, that would also gunk up my channel a ton. Have I ever thought about having guests in my LPs? Yes, but I'm not going to. Not unless, of course, they're like a co-op. If they're a co-op LP, then I'll do it. But otherwise, no. Won't do it. The reason why is because if I have a guest on, I then have to want. I then have to worry about uh, having that guest on each time for consistency stake. Nostalgia chip. Uh. I'll have to come back for that later. There's a nano there. Hey, where are you going? I mean, we're gonna have to come back here to for a lot of different missions. There's a lot of different I think Mandark has some missions for us too. But yeah, uh in order to keep consistency when it comes to um Let's plays, unless I'm doing a co-op. I'd have to keep that guest on each time. And I don't want to do that. So, definitely not happening. If you were wondering if you could get on an LP, no. Wait, what am I doing? The monkeys. Saints Row LP with silver? Probably not happening either. I mean, it could happen, but there's no guarantee. Mainly because silver's always busy. Like, silver's got kind of a life. So... And we'd have to find a lot of time to do this LP. Because for an LP, you know, you need consistency, right? Else the LP might drop and, you know, it won't ever get picked back up or ever get finished. So you need some form of consistency. So for the currently the current Mystery Dungeon one that I have, I have to remember to do this every Monday. Uh, that is now a part of my schedule until I finish it. Uh, I want to do a side Let's Play, uh, one that's not blind, so I can have that backlog and just post it up each week, so that way if I don't, 
have the Mystery Dungeon one, there's still a consistent Let's Play that people can watch off to the side. Of course, I need to figure out what I'm gonna let's. I'm not. I, I need to figure out what else I'm gonna do a let's play of. But um, that is something that I need to keep in consideration. Let's play channels thrive off of consistency. If you are not consistent, then you don't really have an LP going here. Uh, you don't have a good LP. So. Hey, where you going? Unfortunately, when it comes to doing co-op Let's Plays, it's gonna be a while before I get to the point where I can do one. Um, so if it does happen, or there's a, a Saints Row co-op between Silver and I, it's not gonna happen for quite some time. Yeah, I need to figure out what else I want to let's play, though. And I need to figure out what day I'm going to do them, too. Probably Wednesday. Monday and Wednesday sounds good, but... Monday and Friday also sounds good. Monday, Thursday, I don't know. It's definitely going to be Monday and something else, though, because, you know... The Mystery Dungeon Let's Play was posted on a Monday, so... Uh... And then I just need to make, like, this backlog of something else to let's play. Preferably something not blind. Because I want to make sure that I can just have that backlog. There's a kind of a reason I haven't done a let's play in a while. It's <laughs> basically what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Yeah, there was kind of a reason why that channel was dead for so long. It's really hard to do Let's Plays. You might think, oh, it's just playing a video game for like 20 minutes. No. <sighs> you gotta worry about the consistency. Hex? All the way in Devil's Bluff? The shit? Okay. Oh shit. That's fine. Also, I noticed you have a fucking another loco nut mission for me. Five sickle simians. Yo, Hex, I'm gonna do your mission later. We're right next to the fucking sickle simians. about the LPs you haven't finished, like Crystal and H1? Those are stream series. They're not technic- They're kinda LPs, but they're stream series, so I can come back to them whenever. Cause I still have a consistency with my, uh, my streams, right? I stream every fucking morning. So I can come back and do those whenever. Uh, and I do plan to come back to them sometime. They're on my to-do list now. We will come back to them at some point.
but those are stream series. They're not, they're Let's Plays, but they're not at the same time. It's like, but, uh, they're str like, they're series that I come back to for streams. But since I have that consistency, you know, I can keep coming back to it whenever I need to, whenever I feel like it. No, what was it? On the Doodle Show's channel, I used to do, uh, two Let's Plays a day. And they were scheduled out. It was like, 12 different fucking Let's Plays. They're their own separate series, yeah. Crystal and Cage wanted their own separate series. This is an alpha eight. I don't need this. Whatever. I'll take it out, it's no big deal. Or it'll take me out, holy shit. Yeah. No, so... I used to do like, fucking 12 Let's Plays a week. And it used to just be, like, scheduled off. It's like, oh, every Monday I would post, I think it was Ark Survival Evolved and, like, Quantum Conundrum. Uh, day two, like, Tuesday was, uh... I don't entirely remember her. It's been so long. But, the, but Tuesday would be two others, Wednesday would be two others, Thursday would be two others, Friday would be two others. And then Saturday and Sunday I'd have off. Well, not really, because Saturdays were my review series, uh, days. And then, uh, Sunday... I know, Saturday I had the Saturday streams and the fucking, um, review channel. And then Sunday, typically I had a commentary by then. That was, that was 2016 me. That was, that was my schedule in 2016. I released 15 videos a week in 2016. That was my regular output. Now look at me. I just struggle to get a video out a week. Struggle to get a video out any two weeks, even. Yeah, burnout is a very real thing, kids. Don't work yourself to death. This has been a PSA from 2016 Doodle.
Those are we happy few LP count as a separate series? No, those are just extra streams because those weren't even really an LP. Those were just me streaming. Like, they're in the extra streams playlist. They're not even in their own playlist. You're now a millionaire in Pokemon Shield? Hmm. Okay. That's cool, I guess. Oh, there it is. Next time I go to Orchard Bay, I actually need to register something there, too. And then I need to find the one at... Wherever else I need to find one at. That's a weird looking... That's like the small ones, but bigger. Oh, jeez. See, I never got this far in my initial playthrough of, uh, Fusion Fall back in the day. I never got this far. Actually, I might have. No, I don't think I ever did. Because I don't re remember going into the Dinosaur Pass Infected Zone. So this is literally going to be my first time going in there. Oh, you got a mission Need for a me. Mission. I cover the sunglasses. Is that in the infected zone? If it's not, I'm gonna have a problem. Okay, it's not, so... <coughs> I'm not doing it yet. Uh, so how the fuck do I get into this thing? Yeah, I've never gotten this far. Stop 
I don't know how to break this one either. Oh, it gives run and jump, like, out the gate. That's cool. Oh, we gotta go that way. How are you supposed to go over there? Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> uh, if only I had the squad, I could break this so hard. I could just go over this wall and go and get Hex. I could do that if I had the squad. I don't have the squad, though. Because that lo wall is very low. You know what? Fuck it, we're gonna go back and get the squad. <laughs> Fuck it, when I have the squad, I can... I can just, like, fly through this anyway. Let's go back and get the squad for this shit. Wilt, plutonium, squad, let's go. Why did it reset my mission? Fuck. Okay, I guess I need to exit the infected zone real quick. Come back into it. Yeah, I'm gonna break the game real quick. <clears throat> Don't mind me. Okay. Oh, fuck off. Oh, come on! The shit. Okay, fuck off. I don't know where the jump boost was put- where- where the jump boost... Is that? Because it was supposed to be there, but we can still do this. Alright, watch this, guys. I- I'm telling you. <laughs> I can break this game so easily. There he is! Just like that! I mean, we don't get a heal, but who cares? We don't have to go through this. That was so easy. Hey. 
I mean, just, the portal's like right here. It's so fucking dumb. I love how dumb this this game's platforming can be sometimes. Oh shit. Go back in. I want to get rid of the squad. So we, we only need it for infected zones. It is super funny. It's like you could probably get that entire fucking in the fusion layer in one clip because that was so fast. We're not even speedrunning this. We just do. Shell fragment. Oh, I need to kill these things, don't I? Dude, maybe one of these days I should speedrun this game. The problem is, is I don't like the rule set. You can only take two hour breaks for a run that's 35 hours long. I don't like that, actually. So I'd probably never do it. But considering how much of this game I know how to break... I'd be probably decent at it. Yeah. I think their rule set is kind of garbage, and there's only going to be ever one person that runs it. There's the queen. Surprisingly, it doesn't have more than one friend. Well, like, if I dedicated an entire, like, three days to it, I could so do it. Current record, as I said, it's a 35-hour run. And it's probably not even the best you could do. Because it's only been one run. So it's incredibly unoptimized. It's like a 35 hour run. You get a two hour break. That's so dumb. I don't like that rule. I could spend a week in, like, speedrunning this. Doing an entire any percent run. But don't fucking expect me to only take a two hour break. I need it. I need sleep. It's so dumb. I mean, I could, it's just the rule set sucks. Honestly, I hate a lot about that rule set, because you don't even end the run when you beat Fuse. You 
in the run at Humongousaur. The last nano you get. It's like, that's not any percent. You didn't even beat Fuse. You also can't have any friends, which... I mean, I guess I understand, but also no? Like, there's not a co-op section for the run? Just the solo? Like, you can't do a, a co-op speedrun? Okay, cool. Go off, I guess. I really don't like how that board is ran. You also cannot, under any circumstances, do the run under an, an event that gives you extra XP. Which I understand on premise, but the problem is, is there's very often times where Fusion Fall does things that give you extra XP. So you almost can never do the run. It's like, I understand the idea on premise. Sure, cool, understandable. But it's like, it makes it very limiting to when you can and can't actually run. It's like, okay, how many times can you do the run? Oh, d d is there an event? No? Okay, then you can run. It's like, I get it on premise, because you don't want to give... You don't want to give people who run at a certain time a, a, an unfair advantage. I get that. That's understandable. But it's, it's very hard to do that when Fusion Fall consistently does shit like that. So it's, it's kind of hard to work around. That looks like one. Go, It's like... The rules are... I understand why some of these rules exist. I just don't agree with them. Like, let me... Let me go to their, their rules page and, and read, read them off, basically, right? Okay, Fusion Fall Retro. Any percent. View rules. The timer starts as soon as you gain movement in the tutorial. Okay, makes sense. I'm, I have no problems with that. Um, and the timer ends as soon as you obtain the Humongousaur Nano. But why? Is this subject to change when you beat Lord Fuse, as most people would consider Fuse as beating the game? Well, then why isn't it just beat Fuse? Why is it right now the Humongousaur Nano? Is it because that's the how the one run did it? Well, I'm sorry that he was not wanting to put in the full effort. Okay, hold on. I actually gotta focus. 
Oh fuck. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know the clock is moving. You called? Looking for turbo. Game time at the buzzer. No. Oh fuck. We might be in trouble. Fuck. Catch you later. Okay. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> also, hello, Jaceva. I was focusing because you've got very, very limited time limit on this shit. Okay, but yeah. Uh, so timer starts as soon as you gain movement in the tutorial. Timer ends as soon as you obtain the humongous horn nano. But that doesn't make sense because you know Lord Fuse is the actual end of the game. But fine, fine, fair, fair, whatever. Ugh. So the run, nobody's a grouping. There's not even a section, there's not even like a subcategory where you can do that, which sucks. If slash when a live check occurs, the timer is stopped. I'm not even sure what that means. Timer resumes when the player hits the enter game button. So I guess if like a... Uh, I guess if you crash, you can stop the timer, and then it resumes when you enter the game. Okay, that's fair. That's fine. I have that for Dream, actually. No buddy warps, Taro trading, hacking, slash cheating around. Uh, uh, allowed. Okay, I guess. I still think there should be a subcategory for that, but whatever. Exploits are allowed. Tab firing, double jumps, alt jumps, auto skip tutorial. Understandable. Runners are allowed to break as they see fit. So it gives you as many breaks as you need. As long as in the documented footage, they specify when they are taking a break and show the current experience they have upon leaving and entering from said break. Where's the two hour thing? They actually had, in the original post, right, the, the Champ DDF thing, it's like only f oh, okay, they changed it. It says only five breaks are allowed for the run, as the run is, as the run is more than 30, 30 plus hours, breaks not exceed two hours. Never mind. So it looks like they changed it from the guy's original run. Yeah, no, 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 I think they actually tweaked this one. So honestly, okay, I like that now. It wasn't like that when I looked at it yesterday, though. It said the two-hour thing. That was kind of stupid. If at any point the runner takes a break, does not show their experience numbers from the character me menu, whether before exiting or upon returning to the game, the run may not be verified. That's fair. This run cannot be performed during an event which rewards extra fusion matter. E.g. Kanishmas, Valentine's Day, etc. The reason being that when no events are taking place, all the runners will be on an even playing field. And that's, I think that's the big one that I don't like. Okay. Because it's like, I get it on premise. You know, you don't want people just waiting for, uh, really? I didn't even put away Utonium Nano, what the fuck? Oh, right. Zoom. Bye. Well, at the buzzer. Number two. 
shit. Yeah. Damn it! Oh, this is so... Oh, this is hard. This is actually a difficult mission. Holy shit. This is unforgiving. Okay. This is un that was unforgiving, actually. You had so little time to do anything. Jesus. Are you looking for a mission? Are you looking for a mission? Very well. Until next time.
mission, mission, move along. Hello. Do you guys have any more missions for me? Doesn't look like they do. Okay. Let's go back up on the ship, because I think there might be more missions up there. Yeah. I, I could... I could, uh... Like, designate an entire... Weekend to just speedrunning this game. Actually, now that I look at the rules, I just, uh, I don't like how, because I don't know, is there an event going on right now? I actually don't know. I don't think there would be. Thing is, though, that seems like something I'd want to do as, like, a sub goal or something. Or a follower goal. Kind of like how I've got a Harry Potter trifecta for 15 subs. And, uh... What is it? MX Unleashed. Uh, career any for a thousand followers. Fire swamps. Okay, both of them are in fire swamps. The Olymp we actually can go to the hunter's crest, but don't really need to do that right now. Need to head off to the fire swamps. How? What is the path to that though? Into Dino's Pass. Okay. I mean, they do, but I haven't really been paying much attention. <clears throat> All I know is right now is they got that new bank thing, but I don't know if that's an event or not. I don't think they would, but... There we go. There's the fire swamps. be these things. These are lizards. The Lizard Queen did not have Lizard Queen skin. That's 
sounds really wrong. The Lizard Queen did not have Lizard Queen skin. Oh, fuck. There's something really disturbing about the message. The Lizard Queen did not have a Lizard Queen skin. It's also kind of funny how, how many Lizard Queens there are. Okay, I have Lizard Queen skin. Ah, fuck off. Magma Hulks. Where are those? Are those them? Guys, the Lizard Queen did not have Lizard Queen skin. <laughs> I find that really funny. Cheeseburgers? I don't know. What about them? Yeah, I know you missed it. I had to get a uh, Lizard Queen skin from a Lizard Queen, and I killed a few of them, and uh, it was saying, oh, the Lizard Queen did not have Lizard Queen skin. The Lizard Queen 
did not have the skin of a lizard queen. <laughs> On my way to a few queens, actually. Lizard Queen did not have Lizard Queen skin. Okay, I know over here has a lot of missions for me. Uh, let's head to Tech Square, and then I think Offworld Plaza's gotta be for us too. <laughs> Twitter. The Lizard Queen did not have Lizard Queen skin. The digitizer and the forsaken va No fucking way. We get to see what's in there after all. Guys, you know what this means? Off world plaza can wait actually. <laughs> We can go into that- okay. So there was this, like, red portal thing that I tried going into when we went into the, um... Forsaken Zone, right? Or the Forbidden Zone? And I wanted to see what was in there, but I couldn't go in there because I didn't have the right mission. We now have the right mission.
And you want to go through a Doom portal exactly why? Because it was... It was... Look, look, okay. I saw this thing back here. See this? I was curious as to what this was. And now we have an answer. Oh. oh. This is so cool. Oh. Hello. Hi, Dexter. This is so cool looking! Upgraded hell. We have to beat thirty of these fucking mandarks, by the way. I want to point that out. We have to beat 30 of these things. Yeah, hope you guys like seeing Mandarks get their fucking shit kicked in. Okay. Um, actually, that's a pretty good power. Scavenge is always good. It's good to have an extra scavenge.
To be fair, we had a years of obnoxious laugh for an entire episode straight. I'd say we even. What does scavenge do? So scavenge, I actually have a scavenge nano. Um, Buttercup is a, a scavenge nano. So basically what it does is it gives me e uh, extra XP from the things that I kill and from quests that I do. So you'll see me, uh, when I walk up to finish up a mission, typically you'll see me pull out Buttercup so I can get that extra XP. That's what it does. But I was just getting started. Where are you headed? Off we go. So all that having an extra scavenge nano does is it means I can mix up my team if I so choose. To be fair though, I don't think I have a, a standard team that I could switch out for. Maybe? We'll see. Let's go to nanos. So I want like one speed boost, one scavenge, and one healing. So Computrus is a Cosmics. Actually, isn't this also a sca- yeah, this is also a C scavenge. So I don't have like an A scavenge, I don't think. Yeah. I don't have an A scavenge, Nano. That would be cool. We could need to- we probably could get that, actually. Uh, jump... So C... So B... It's an A. Okay, so I guess the- If I ever wanted to switch out number two for something... For like a- I guess a- A scavenge nano, it would be Courage. But if I really wanted to, I could switch out now for Computress or for Forearms. Uh, it's for it's healing. There's a ton of healing nanos I have. I have Eduardo. I have him. Or him. I've actually uh, changed out for him a couple of times. Um. I've got. Dem no, Demongo's revive. We've got number three, which is a C health. A bunch of healing now, so where's the other one? Looks like we got a few run nanos actually too. The only ones that's hard to get are the fucking scavenge ones. But that's because scavenge is so good. You need a mission? Good luck. Alright. Okay. So let's see where everything has gotta go. Okay, I gotta go to Tech Square. Where is this one? Steam Alley. Yeesh. Kevin's all the way out in nowhere. Ray stabilizer. Is that nearby? No, that's all the way out in really twisted forest. Okay, so the closest one we got is this one. So let's go do this one first. Ah. 
Well, the next scavenge nano that I get is a fucking, uh, courage, which is cool. I guess. Mojo's Volcano? Okay. I can stop there, I guess. Actually, Mojo should have a mission for me. Problem is, is I don't have any more room, I guess, for extra missions. I kind of wish you could, like, fill up on missions to do. Like, you didn't have a... a you didn't have, like, a, a limited amount of missions you can hold. That'd be cool. Galaxy Gardens, okay. Hey -ya. Oh, actually. Because I might actually have to fight stuff. I want to make sure that I can get stuff out of it. There's a lot of foot. I'm running alone, but um, that's just because I don't got any friends on here. <laughs> but there are there are a bunch of people playing this, um, I think. At least there's enough. Just that I don't got any friends on here. Also, I did an Explorers of Sky- or I started an Explorers of Sky Let's Play yesterday. For anyone who didn't see. Turns out I'm a Piplup. I mean, I just got started. N not even out of, like, the first area. I 
playing the Piplup, and my partner in crime is Sparky. He is a, uh, he is a Shinx. Actually, I'd like to, I, I, I kind of want to, kind of want to rant about something real quick about, um, Mystery Dungeon. Because I learned that, uh, <laughs> I learned that you can't be a Shinx if you're female. But it's like, that's bullshit, because I distinctly remember there being a female Shinx in the Mystery Dungeon, like, little anime special thing. So what the fuck you mean you can't be a female Shinx in Mystery Dungeon? That's bullshit! <laughs> hey, Emma. Yeah, I went through it. There's, there's a lot of like gender specific ones. It's like you can't be a. I think it's a skitty if you're male. You can't be a munchlax if you're female. Oh, it's literally right beside him. Are you receiving me? How the fuck am I supposed to get up there? It's like this. Tyrannical Gardens infected zone, so that's in Galaxy Gardens. That's just across the way.
You know, if I had the squad, I could probably break this again. You guys want to see me break this with the squad again, or do you guys want to see me just, like, go through this whole thing? You guys like it when I break it with the squad? Because breaking this with the squad would be really easy. It's just over this hill. You know what? Feck it. I'm gonna go get the squad. Might have to go back into the infected zone, though. Alright, now I just have to come back here. We're gonna go get the squad. Squad's my favorite thing to do in, in, fact, uh, in specifically fusion layers. Because they're so broken. Well, I don't know if you know what I mean by the squad. But the squad consists of... Wilt, number two, and, uh, Professor Utonium. And it is the most broken shit ever. The squad is back, boys. So that gives you kind of an idea of what each of them do. Utonium gives me a double jump. Wilt gives me a high jump. Number two speeds me up. So what I do... That's the squad. Bye bye. Game time. Crazy air. Hey. <laughs> and that's what the squad does. <laughs> It is so unbelievably broken. <laughs> it is very, very broken. <laughs> You can get the squad really, really early on. <laughs> Dude, that's the greatest part. <laughs> the squad is so broken. And the boys go breaking uh <laughs> fusion layers. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> Me and the boys just go break infusion layers like. <laughs> So whenever I say the squad, this, like... This is the fucking bullshit <laughs> Hold on. I got a stupid meme for that later. Anyway. Actually, no. I wanna see if there's anything better than what I currently have. Um, literally the same. Is even a pistol? Oh, okay, so we got a little shirt here. It's better than what I got. Ski shirt can be gotten rid of. So for for whatever anything that I have that's currently better than what I have, we're gonna put it down here so that way it doesn't accidentally get sold. Uh, do I got any pants that are better than what I got? Or shoes? Another shirt that's better than what I got. Is it better than this one? 182, 184. Okay, so this one's getting sold. This one's getting capped. One eighty Oh, okay, but this is the this is the Dexter armor. I can't really sell that anyway. But Jesus fucking Christ, two hundred. Well, this is better than what I got by a hefty margin too. Jeez. We're gonna need to like swap uh, things so I can see if there's anything better here. Well, that's also better by a hefty margin. All right. I've got armor for sale. Looks a bit weird right now, but no idea when I'm gonna get the rest of the armor set, so. Alright, so we gotta go off to fucking 
really twisted forest and nowhere, so I guess let's head back to the uh, wild. Definitely want to keep this, uh, this shirt, though. Because, you know, it's got to stay fashionable. That looks weird. High fashion. Got that little... Gothic, uh, shtick going on here. Oh my god, the class of 3000. I saw that. You can't. Don't just act like I didn't see that. Class of 3000. I mean, it's classic class of 3000, but... Absolutely, Sunny Bridges had a great hat. Courage is fucking frightening, by the way. Can we just take some time to talk about this? Oh no, I, I agree they knew how to jam. It's kind of a catch you later. Hey, come in. Very nice web and bye. If I'm just regular nightmares. <laughs> oh god. Hi, catacombs. At least we're just gonna do something in the lower catacombs. That's fine.
Don't even got the boys. We don't even got the squad. Which sucks, because I could totally use the squad, like, right here. Problem is, is I can't get the squad for, for this mission. So we're just gonna do this like normal. That's fine, though. We don't need the squad all the time. The squad's so fucking broken, though. <laughs> God, it's so fun. We need to go down here, it looks like. These things are very giant. I could probably... <gasps> I didn't even need the squad! Broke this shit on my own! <laughs> Didn't even need the squad! Get fucked, game! I mistook what I was supposed to kill. Whoops. Killed the wrong thing. That's fine. We just go to that same spot, break the game again, and go after Vilgax instead of Juniper this time. It's fine. Kill Belgax first. And it's regular Belgax too, not fusion Belgax. Allow me to repeat something that I said in the previous stream. I fucking hate the catacombs. Oh, Area 51.5, okay. Let's go right Area 51.5, guys.
Are these little guys supposed to be? Oh. To beat 15 of these little guys? I don't even remember these guys being here. I'm just one shot them all. You got dumplings? Okay. Enjoy your dumples. Guess we're going over there later. Urgent message. Have I eaten today? No. It's like nine, nine thirty or something like that. Go eat? It's like 9.30 and I'm not done streaming yet.
Road to 36 Part 31? What's so funny about that? This is the 31... And this is the 31st stream that we have done a Fusion Fall Retro trying to get to level 36. Do I need to go into the infected zone for this? Probably. Gross. This is literally the only time that I ever have a team like this.
Okay, Monkey Mountain and Monkey Mountain, of course. These are sickle simians. We want scythe simians.
Oh shit. I wasn't paying attention to my health. I'm also haven't been paying attention to time. Jesus fuck. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and hop off. Let's go see who we can raid. There's no one live. Of course there's not. Why would there be? So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and hop off. Later, everyone.